Hey everyone, it's Brett. I hope you're doing well and hope you're having a good week. Today we're going to be talking about Psalm 34 verses 1 through 3. So we're going to read that and then we're going to dive into what that means for us today. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. My soul makes boast in the Lord. Let the humble hear and be glad. O oh, magnify the Lord with me and let us exalt his name together. And so today I'm going to be focusing primarily on this first verse. And this first verse is very focused on continually and constantly worshiping God and that being our mindset and that being how we live our lives. And so it may sound weird at the beginning, so I will bless the Lord at all times. And this is just saying I will praise the Lord at all times. I will glorify the Lord at all times. I will adore Him. I will extol Him. I will bless the Lord. And the second part I want to point out in this is that it talks about how that we should praise God. The God's praise should constantly be on our lips and constantly be in our mouths. And it, our words should reflect that. And so my question for us today is, is your words reflecting God? Are your words reflecting God? And not just your words specifically talking about God or the Bible or Jesus, but are all your words reflecting God and are they glorifying Him? And because, so these verses are about worshiping God. And the thing is, worship is not just singing. That's a huge part of it and it's great as believers and as a community of Christians we get together and we sing and we praise the Lord in song but the thing is worship is not just that but we can worship God through our lives. It's not just singing but how we live our lives, how we talk to other people and how we live things out can be worship and can praise and glorify God. So specifically with this verse, the first one, or it's in the second part, it says, His praise shall continually be in my mouth. So I don't know about you, but I know certain times in my life, um, or at least in just throughout the week, where my words aren't necessarily glorifying or praising God. And so I want you to take a deep look at the words you're using today and throughout the week and ask yourself, are my words praising God? Are they glorifying Him? Because the thing is, if we actually were constantly and continually worshiping God with our words and with our life, then a lot of the other issues that we have in our lives would go away. It doesn't mean they would all go away, but a lot of the different stuff that comes up throughout the week would disappear because we would have the mindset and the focus of worshiping God. And so the last thing I want to end with today is just this verse 3 of, Oh, magnify the Lord with me, and let us exalt him, let us exalt his name together. So I challenge you this week to look at your life and look at your words. Are you worshiping God and are you doing it constantly? Is that the focus you have? Um, and I pray that we can just come and worship God together. Thanks.